Hello guys, welcome to Filament Daily. Today I want to show you one feature, kind of small feature and experimental feature even it is called, that was released in Filament in version 3.0.46 a few weeks ago. I am talking about SPA mode with Wire Navigate. In general, SPA seems to be kind of like a movement in web development, not only in Filament or Laravel, single page applications seem to be a sexy thing. Which has a good idea, what does it mean to have a single page? So you load all your assets with JavaScript once, and then whenever you click some link on your page, you still have the same single page, but only some part of that page is reloaded with its HTML or something like that. For user experience, it's much better because they don't have to wait to reload all the page with all the assets and JavaScript and everything. And I remember doing something like that with JavaScript almost 20 years ago, like reloading some parts in iframes and stuff like that. And in Laravel and with Filament and with Livewire, it became much more easier. You don't even need to write any JavaScript for that. Livewire has a feature called Wire Navigate for that, which appeared in Livewire 3 and Filament introduced that behavior as well, which is really easy to enable. But it has its downsides. It's not that stable. So Dan Herring, the creator of Filament, opened that issue a long time ago and there's a huge discussion between when it works, when it doesn't work. It seemed to be stable in most cases, but if you look at the docs, that feature is marked as experimental. So this is the documentation, which actually is three letters method. And warning in the docs, feature is experimental. And if you encounter any bugs, those bugs are in most cases not from filament, but rather from live wire three. Okay, let me demonstrate now. So we have a regular simple filament project. And if we navigate between the links, the whole page is refreshing. If we take a look at the network tab of browser, if we load, as you can see, a lot of things are loaded. So 24 requests to the server. And if we click any other link, again, 24 requests. Now, if we enable SPA with those three letters, as I mentioned, so in your admin panel provider, you just add SPA here. That's it. You don't need to manually write wire navigate or activate anything else. We refresh and the first time it is 24 requests, but if we click anything else, another menu item, as you can see, those requests are up to 30. So 24 older requests and then only six on top. So we had posts and then we have tags with only some JavaScript reloaded. I'm not sure exactly how that works and why JavaScript is reloaded specifically, but this is how it works. So if we click on tasks, as you can see, we have one update with Livewire and then tasks with JavaScript again. Click on users, again, users with five JavaScript file. So in theory, it loads faster, but to be honest, I didn't notice a massive difference from user experience in this case. Maybe I would have noticed that on slower network connection or with more complex tables than these ones. So you could experiment with that. Again, it's an experimental feature. And if you do use that SPA or wire navigate in your live wire projects, I would be happy to discuss, to hear your experience. Does it work? Does it make the UX better? Does it have any bugs and how you overcome them? Because to me personally, all that SPA movement is very overrated. So it makes the code overly complicated for not that much benefit in most projects. What do you think about that as well? Just philosophically, we can discuss in the comments below. Subscribe to the channel to get more filament videos like this one and see you guys in other videos.